What makes St. Paul special is the people. Every day they demonstrate their commitment to compassionate care, to social justice, to providing excellent care and bringing innovation to the system. In the early 80s, I was called to help out uh, with this very unusual form of pneumonia, what later on turned out to be HIV and AIDS. As the efforts that were made here at St. Paul's, we now have a strategy that is able to totally change the outlook of HIV. I've been able to see just what a caring hospital it is, how all the employees care so much about the patients. One of the great things about St. Paul's is that it supports innovation, both in research and in clinical care, and I think what's been great and the reason that we've been able to create these novel models and test them and then propagate them is that there's that permissive environment here. The kidney department delivers care to people who need dialysis, who need care before dialysis, and who need transplants. St. Paul's is in a very unique situation in terms of Canadian urban hospitals. Uh, we have a disparate population. We have people who are in the impoverished areas of the downtown east side, as well as people who are in the upper middle class areas of the West End. So we get a broad range of psychiatric illness with this. And there's huge structural barriers for individuals and families struggling with addiction because of the stigma and the moral judgments placed around addiction. We really need to mobilize a workforce of physicians with the skills and expertise to apply evidence-based medicine principles when it comes to addiction care. To me, St. Paul's is a hospital with a soul that is looking holistically at the community and seeking to actively find people who aren't being represented well and ensures that they get the care they deserve. The lung program at St. Paul's Hospital is one of the largest in the province and probably the most robust and renowned. At St. Paul's Hospital, we've been tackling addressing the burden of COPD over the past 40 years. And there's a set of values here that guides the people and guides the care that is provided in this hospital. It's a hospital with heart. I think innovation at St. Paul's helps patients tremendously. I've been able to develop brand new procedures that have never been available anywhere else. St. Paul's Hospital takes a lot of pride in knowing that they really have largely led transcatheter heart valve therapy globally. One of the things that we don't want to lose is the culture, the fiber, the heartbeat of St. Paul's Hospital, what made us great to where we are today. That's something we need to hold on to as we look to the future. Your support is much appreciated. Thank you.